Hello, my name is Adrienne Moharic, and I'm a Developer Experience Engineer at Cisco. I work with many teams within Cisco to improve the developer experience of Cisco's APIs through their documentation, which is what I want to talk to you about today. I'm going to explain to you why you should care about the documentation of an API, how the API documents are usually treated, how you can help improve the docs no matter what your job role is, and provide you a handy tool to help your team create great API documents. So let's talk about first impressions. Developers refer to the documents to make their first API request. Their ease of use of the API affects adoption of the API. For example, imagine having a hard time getting started with the API. You may get frustrated or confused. However, common side effects of good documentation and easily making your first API request successfully include, but are not limited to, experiences of joy, a sense of accomplishment, a positive attitude, a self-high five, a win-win attitude, a good spirit, and hope for the future. <laughs> so a good first impression is what we're striving for. I think one of the ways we can provide developers with that satisfaction is through simple and clear documentation. What do you mean putting docs in a corner? Well, I'm glad you asked. I've experienced the release of an API similar to this process, and I've noticed when an API is being built, docs aren't usually top of mind. They tend to get thrown over to the typewriter to figure out. For a REST API, the Open API specification document may include all of the features of an API, but the examples in the document shouldn't include foo and bar, which makes it harder for developers to understand the context. Also, top use cases and the developer story aren't clearly, aren't clearly documented in the introduction of the document. If developers aren't sure why the API should be used, they may not use it and use a competitor's API instead. If you're thinking, but I'm not a tech writer, what can I do? Well, I've got good news for you. If you're in any way involved in the API, you can help improve the docs. Pick a role that most closely resembles your role and see how you can help. Product managers can ensure everyone involved with the API understands the developer story and top use cases. This ensures everyone is on the same page when contributing to examples. They can kick off the creation and workflow of the docs at the beginning of the API lifecycle instead of closer to the end. And of course, the product manager can ensure the docs get updated with every update to the API. If you're an engineer, you can provide code samples for common use cases, generate machine readable definitions of the API, and clearly define successes and errors to help developers with troubleshooting. If you don't know which language to write the code samples for, ask your customers what they use. Tech writers can enhance descriptions and examples to closely resemble real world examples. But wait, there's more. Now that you know what you can do to help make the document successful, here's a tool to add to your tool bag. Call today to get access to the DevX doc checklist to help ensure that the documents clearly and easily help a developer use the API. As you can see, the checklist is pretty long, so we've split it up so that the developer advocate and the tech writer who didn't write the docs use this checklist to review the docs prior to publishing. Not everything is required. The checklist also includes recommendations to, prove, to provide room for improvement. So if you're interested in that checklist, you can download it here. Grab your phone, take a picture of the QR code, or type in this URL. You will also be able to download the checklist on the DevNet Create website where the videos are being recorded. This special offer will last long. We're giving it to you for free. No taxes or shipping and handling fees added to this exclusive offer. No signups or annoying pop-ups either. So, with Patrick Swayze on your side, your docs can fly. Thank you.